Association to reconsider Fox's front row privileges. Joining me now is Nathan Daschle, Executive Director of the Democratic Governors Association. What's the big deal here? Where do they sit in, in, in the press briefing? What do you think, Nathan? Well, Ed, you know, you said it right off the bat. Um, the Fox News violated a very, very fundamental principle that we hold dear, which is that the media ought to be independent of those they cover, particularly when it comes to something as important as politics. Fox News grossly violated this principle when they gave an unprecedented $1 million to the Republican Governor Association, whose sole def purpose is the defeat of Democratic governors. Now, on another story, uh, you went after Fox News and wanted a formal disclaimer of Fox's coverage in gubernatorial races uh, because of this donation, and they responded. Brian Lewis, Fox News spokesman, said Nathan Stunt has run its course as 15 minutes are up. Time to leave the stage. What's your response to that? You know, they can call this a stunt all they want. This is a very, very important principle, which is the principle of transparency. If Fox News wants to be an independent media organization, then don't give a million dollars to defeating Democratic governors. But if you want to be a political organization, if you want to inject yourself in the political arena like this, then why not let the viewers know? I think, you know, in politics, we think it's very important for uh, us to let viewers know where the information comes from. That's why we have disclaimers in state and federal election laws. And here we have a news organization that's given a million dollars to defeating Democratic governors. And I think it's only appropriate that the viewers know that. Are you, they, are, are, you concerned if they, are you concerned if this isn't challenged, where will it stop? I am concerned. I mean, you know, we've always known that Fox News has a conservative bent. There's been no question about that. Fair and balance has always been somewhat of a dubious sloganeering. Now it's just a complete joke. Now they are in the bag with the Republican Party. They are literally bankrolling the Republicans. And I think that if we don't stop it, you know, Media Matters and other organizations have said to the White House Correspondents Association, that front row is a position that's highly yeah. coveted. Well, it's one that imparts prestige and dignity that's the, just not appropriate for the, this news outlet. It's legal, though. It's, I mean, the, I mean the, the, they're not breaking any laws. Uh, do you think the people in this country quickly are going to connect the dots we'll yeah, see you know they're not they're not breaking any laws and if they want to do this go ahead yeah. our point is just let the viewers know Nathan Dashell good to have you with us tonight thanks so much Thank you.